Ladies and welcome back to my channel. The game I'm going to be playing in this video is Pink Poodle GFX Plays. If you don't know, I actually made this game myself with Savage Unicorn 228. Basically, there's a bunch of different rooms in the game, an outdoor area, a VIP area, and a green screen where you can go take photos. Be sure to come play our game. It's new. It just came out a couple days ago and it's super fun. Also, be sure to join our group, Pink Poodle Studios. This game is not under a creation of the group. It's under my creations because I did not know how to work things. This is the first thing I've ever developed. But the future games that come out will come out under Pink Poodle Studios. And yes, there are going to be more games. Also, Pink Poodle Studios has some merch, which you will see me wearing one of the tops in the video. But there is some merch you can buy. And yeah, I'm really excited to show you guys my own game. Let's get right into the video. <laughs> So before we get into the video, I was requested to give a shout out to the channel Pink Queen, but there's an X between the Q and the U, so I'm not sure how to pronounce that, but I'll call the channel Pink Queen. And I went to check out this channel, and it is a, a super awesome channel, although they only have a few subscribers, I really enjoy their videos. So you guys should definitely go check out Pink Queen. As you guys know, I've never really been asked to do a shout out before, so this is kind of my first time doing it. I'm going to start doing a shout out per video, so if you comment down below and want a shout out, be sure to use a hashtag HeyLovelies in your comment. I will be randomly picking one of the commenters to be the shout out of each video. Be sure to check out Pink Queen's channel. Be sure to leave a comment with hashtag HeyLovelies if you want a shout out. And let's get into the gameplay. Alrighty, so I just got into the game. And as you can see at the bottom, I have quite a few gears. Everyone gets the try and close little guy there. But I'm going to go ahead and put all this stuff away. We have a gravity coil game pass slash speed coil does both. A selfie stick. And then the VIP game pass comes with both the ice cream and the Segway. And we have a cute little entrance right here, and as you continue down, there's a little, like, clothing area that you can use the try-on tool for, but I'm gonna go ahead and remove my fade. If you continue down this little area, there's a kind of, like, garden, I guess, like, an outdoor area that you can take pictures by. There's also a VIP room that you need a the Game Pass for to get into here. And this is a nice little area for you to take GFXs, especially like on this little couch. I think it's really cute. And it makes a nice little GFX. Or over there, and that area is cute. But yeah, there's just a bunch of room here. This area is also really nice if you want to sit in a chair like that. There's clothes you can use the try on tool for to match the room more. This little speed things. And just this little area. If you continue down this way, you can go to the green screen if you go on this little conveyor belt. And I'll take you right up to the green screen. It's pretty big, so there's room for multiple people to be taking pictures at a time or videos. And you could just take a picture of your character here with you doing all the different little emotes if you wanted to. But yeah, this is a nice area for you to, if you're doing like an intro or a thumbnail for YouTube or just if you want to take a green screen picture and then edit in a background later. It's really cool. We have a little game room that you can take pictures in. This one's pretty cool. You can take one by like the TV or at the desk. There's a little picnic area and you can actually take a picture on the swing if I can figure out how to get on it the right way. There we go. The swing does actually swing, and you could take a cute little picture over there or anywhere else in the picnic area. This one is one of my favorites. It is the space kind of room, and you could take a really cool picture like you're in space. You can also hop onto the planets if you want ah. and take one on the planet. Also, if you go up to the astronaut, you do get the little space helmet. At the front, there is a pink bedroom. This one is really cute and I really like this one. 
I like this little desk. I like taking pictures here because I think that's really cute. This next one is my absolute favorite. It is the cafe. And you don't really have to do anything but sit in the chair and take one next to a little cafe sign. And it turns out really nice. There's obviously more like areas you can take pictures. And this coffee machine actually works if you press the button. You'll get a little coffee prop, which is really good if you're doing a GFX there. And the last room is the art studio. This one is also really pretty, especially this little scenery over here and this nice wall with all the art on it. Alrighty lovelies, that is all I have for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed this little video of how to take super cool GFX at the Pink Poodle GFX place. I just showed you guys like some areas I like to take the pictures in and just kind of how I do them. You can obviously take them anywhere in this place and you can use like emotes or not like whatever you please if you guys have any suggestions for new rooms or new things you want to see in this game go ahead and leave a comment on this video or message me on roblox or you can go to the pink poodle studios wall and leave a comment there i love to hear you guys feedback on things especially things that i make so i would love for you guys to say like hey i want to see a summertime room I could definitely get something going for you guys in future updates. I really hope you guys enjoyed looking at the GFX place. Bye guys!